here we go again guys it's maybe the first mountain stage of this career mode and the first mountain stage i've ever driven in this race in this game of course not this race in this game oh it may be the first stage of the channel let's go let's see what it is it is the first mountain stage of the entire game it is place nice from macon to l'afrique and it has three mountains and ends on a very high steep mountain it is you can't see the category probably no you can't see the category but this will be a very exciting race honestly so let's see how we can make it work i probably won't will be a favorite in this race so we with Froom, take us and let me guess come on fast 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 who's the guy that won this, the hill stage yeah costa and costa as well of course but the pork is i actually expected van der Brook to be a favorite he did pretty recently. He did, he did pretty decently recently in the, the Tour of France a couple of years ago. So I expect him to be a bit further up. So Dimar is actually on the point standings now because he got second place. Yay! Do I have any other riders here? No, I don't have any other favorites. So uh, that's a Puma. And uh, Gralak is going to help get up the getting uh, Quintana up the hills as fast as possible before they fall off. Well, team Tinker of Saxobank has a lot of good riders. They have, uh, let, me, let me see. Where is the? Kreuziger, Boaro, Hernandez, Maika, Roach, Rogers, they're all about over 17 in climbing. So it's a Puma. It's usually your Quintana. And who's the second best climber after? A, a fourth best climb after Kredak. It's probably actually a little tricks on again. Just like in the hill states the other day. And I'll make these two guys relax again. Just mark each other. Hopefully they all do reasonably well. Can you order the mountains? And then Larson or Lander. Who's the best there, honestly? Not really any of them, so they'll just set the pace on this flat road here. I'll set a high pace, actually, I think. Make the race a bit tough for the guys to keep up with. Quintana and Greta can move a bit up front. Let's set up the pace a bit. Cool, and go. Early uh, winner of the Dio d'Italia, a lot of years ago. People sort of forgot about him because he didn't live up to his potential. People probably thought he would be a multi-time Tour de France and Dior Italia winner, but he hasn't really done much since then. He won a couple of classics. I believe he won the uh, Amstel Gold Race, uh, Maastricht Valkenburg, or whatever you want to call it, a couple of years ago, if I remember correctly. But Larson and Landa is setting a high pace up front. Last and Kifko. It's not really that strong of a breakaway. That has escaped, as you can see. Nice Ludwigsson. Ludwigsson is. Uh, both of these guys make the through with the Peloton, so they're not. I, I really want to attack with them and hopefully I can get a surprise day twin. If they don't catch the group, because he's pretty strong in the uh, mountains, these guys. But they're not far enough behind, so that if they get away, they'll probably. Pelton will probably catch them immediately as well. These guys are up front. Oh, they're actually pretty sure as well. But uh, I'll catch them anyway, because I'm setting a rough pace. What's that? What's the spring stand, actually? Up to 10th with Demara. Kwiatkowski was second in both stages, both in the sprint and the climb, and he probably got a point, some points as well in the sprint the other day. Some guys have felt Simon and just Jan Seven Rendsburg. As expected. Uh, Lander, you can you can get some bottles for us. Who won the sprint? I didn't even see who won the sprint. 
events. No, it's, it's bro five letters. So you click here. No sprint status. Kill one actually. Three points for kill in three seconds. Jaren just got some seconds and Hawk has got some seconds as well. Didn't even, didn't even care about this being in that race. On that sprint, not that race. The sprint. Last one is almost, almost dead, so is Lander. They're going to be completely dead when we get to the mountains. And this is only flat road of so far. So. Should make him relax a bit. Oh, we got ourselves a breakaway. Some good riders. Actually, some okay riders. No hog as well. One of the guys I considered getting for my team when we started this career mode. Just didn't think he was good enough. He probably could be a pretty good riders for some of the hill stages. So I really don't have a guy who is specialized in the hills. Lampo has taken the lead as well now. They of course have the yellow jersey on Ricosta. This is also a decent climber. Good turn, of course, is my captain. Not in good shape, as I said a lot of times, but his stats should make up for it. So hopefully he can keep up to Ricosta. And Froome. I don't think Froome is in good shape as well. Anal Analyze behavior, this is so stupid. I did, and you never really get, you can get the shape out of them. Okay, I'll, I'll try and do it for, for, for fun, season. Leave for Lander. No, Lander can still work, and then Larson. You can uh, analyze Froome's behavior. Interest in leaving the work to the team of the favorite. Better position in the overall rankings. Well, I really guess. Is there, is, is there a way you can see that it's actually. Take position here. Ha! Huh, I'm taking your position. I didn't even know you could do that. That's actually a lot smarter. Analyze behavior. Okay, you don't get any more information from that. Just the same information four times in a row. Okay, and now we're heading up for the first real climb of this entire game. First mountain. Mountain. Help Lander. Go all in. Lander. Sprint. Annoy them as much as possible. Haha, <laughs> break away. You thought you got away. You didn't. And Larson and Lander. At least Okay China's actually still already losing some of this yellow stuff. Yellow in the energy bar. So that's pretty shit. Because that means it's probably won't be of any more help at all. This guy's so far behind. What about down here? They're really trying to keep up. This guy's going to fall off now as well. That's pretty early to fall off the mountain, honestly. I should already push now with Ludwigsson. Maybe I should just leave Kradak here and then use Ludwigsson's power now to go up the mountain. Yeah, I'll put him on the dot and you can just work his ass off. Tearing the group at the front. <laughs> They're tearing each other. Probably for the mountain points. And Robiano won them. In front of Nats and Ede. Simon Clark, will he get some mountain points? Ah! He got some mountain points. Lucky for you. Did I stretch out the pills on a bit? Two 
two guys fell off. And these four guys fell off as well. And well, all of these guys as well. Demar and Kokard are just holding on by the skin of the teeth. Larsen and Land are still exactly the Pilsen, but that's only because they were so far in front of the Pilsen that they still lead. And now we're going downhill. Set up the pace a bit. I really should have gone back for buffs in this place. I'll try to go back for buffs now. Hopefully, Dredd won't die and I lose one of my men on the, this little adventure. Slow the pace down a bit. So far behind now, uh, that's annoying. Please make it up again. Well, we cost us the attack together with Rodriguez. I really don't understand that attack for them. But okay, I can be I can respect that attack like that. Rodrigue is Costa and Sandra Mitter, the three guys in the breakaway. Which is a really stupid breakaway this because it's on a flat road and now they have to work together three people on a flat road while the other captains are just like uh, me and Froome, or whatever Froome even is, We're just saving up power. Is Craddock on its way with bottles? That's all I want to know. He is. He just can't get past. Oh, we caught him actually. Haha. <laughs> Where's Froom? Damn, he's actually pretty far down in the Pilton. Okay, they're setting up. For the fucking sprint now. <laughs> Kittel and uh, Greipen and all the other guys still in the top field. Ah, some land are so dead. Uh, this group is trying to catch up. I fell behind before. They are going to catch up again. They will probably fall behind again. When we get to the. Who's, it? who's attacking? Rubiano again. He's the guy who was in the breakaway as well. There's a lot of energy today, this guy. Frank looks like a second as well. Yeah. I guess that. And Nordhout and I'll... It's the same guy attacking all over again. Eddie, Santa Mita. Oh, it's a sprint now. And Kreipel is sprinting. Gerrans, Kittel, probably Kreibel winning this sprint. Oh, that's a good Gerrans. Gerrans in front of Kreibel and Kittel. Hmm. Where's Gerrans? Where was he? I know he's in the Queen's jersey, but I didn't. I can't see it now. Gerrans. There we are. 24 ward, that's not, that doesn't really like you need it. Yes, 7 in sprint, but still. Uh. Probably set Craddock to work soon. It's probably had lost a lot of his power, but still. Check your energy bar now. Uphill, set the pace up for Craddock a bit.
Oh, catch up. Hey, hey, hey. They didn't get away at all. Gee. No, I don't care about it, Taboo Man. Just get him away. Why can't I? Right click on this fucking guy. Put him on 99. That's what I can do with it right now. Hopefully, I didn't lose it because I fucking couldn't counterattack. This is the stupid thing about this game so far. The counterattack thing. Can cost These two guys are probably going to get first and second in this stage race because they're so dominant so far. Follow the attack for grinding up out. Because it's mid up to the top two guys as well. Not really like they're even getting some distance from the other peloton. Are you serious? Foom just drove away from the rest of us or what? Didn't go as well as planned. Chris Koski looks like he can't give up Costa and Rodriguez anymore. Quintana looks like he's pretty shit. <laughs> ah, oh no, oh no. He's just trying to. They're just trying away from me. Oh no. Who's going to win? Costa is going to win. Hopefully, you just can't even give out Costa. Costa is overpowered at this race. He's probably in pretty good shape as well. Rodriguez, Gwikowski, Roach, Room. Oh, probably be battling for six places, it looks like. Hopefully, you can keep up the beat. Otherwise, I'll be pretty disappointed, honestly. No, he can't keep up the beat. He's going to split with. Is that ninth place? Wow! I'm so good at this game. Uh, my excuse is I'm in bad shape. Both have played this game, and that Quintana was in bad shape. <laughs> okay, let's see how it goes. Still, only need to get a stage win. Luckily, like it's not like some advice today. You need to get on top one. Like, I need to win the Tour de France, and I'm doing this bad. The sponsors want me to win the Tour de France. I really think they have some pretty unrealistic expectations of me. So far. Tech tech. Damn, he's going fast this guy. Hey, only 45 minutes or something like that. After the rest of the coup. Yeah, he wins the least stakes and the least jersey. He was already in the yellow jersey. Ninth overall at the Puma as well. The Puma's in good shape. So that's okay. Let's see his uh, 
said the screen bitterly. See you, March. Start of the March is only. It's in pretty bad shape, honestly. This is the start of the season. So that's okay. Uh, of course, I hope for better stuff. Yeah, that's not really much else to say. In this race, next time we will start the oh, start the first race, the Tiara Attico. We need to get a top three according to the sponsors overall. So we need a guy who's pretty good in the hills. Sadly, so we don't have any guys who are good in the hills. So hopefully, I can make kind of a small miracle happen and well achieve my goal it's going to be hard it's not going to be impossible but uh check in next time and maybe we'll see how we'll how we'll do thanks for watching guys consider subscribing liking if you enjoyed the video and bye